you could ask most of, most of these people that think Gina is just evil person. What what did she do that was wrong? And they could not actually give you a spe- the answer would be like this. It was like, well, I think she did. This. I think it was anti vax anti LGBT stuff. Yes. That would be the answer. That would it be the answer. Be correct. Anything concrete. It wouldn't be Maybe. like she, she said this. Here's the yeah. receipt. It would be nothing like that. It would be like I think. I, well, which more so, I was told by the people that I listened to that she had this position or she said X thing, and therefore she must be punished. It's yeah. fucked up. It is I fucked should. up um, for sure. But like I said, this stuff has real world fucking consequences, and this is why I think these people are especially evil. Yeah. Right? Because this shit is like, for one, it's not really funny, right? It's like, okay, she basically, and she was on a, on a, on a, you know, kind of this, this, this incline with the trajectory of her career. I think we yeah. all would agree on that, mm-hmm. right? Acting in this role that people, people, uh, uh, like that she was a part of, okay? And that all went away like that. Mm-hmm. It, it was gone, right? And, even if people knew the truth, studios for sure was not, they weren't going to touch her. They, they, they were not going to touch her because the narrative that was floating around, albeit was completely fucking false. Yes. Completely false. It was not, it was nothing. There's nothing true about it. I can say this is a person that actually knows Gina personally, right? She's an awesome person, man. Like she is one of the nicest people that I have ever had the pleasure of hanging out with. Like not even fucking joking, not not even not even joking. And you you see her and you interact with her. You see other people interact with her. She goes to these cops. It's nothing but fucking love. And that's the people. Or there's a bunch of jack wagons that are telling us that we're supposed to believe that this person is evil, not because of anything she said, but because they want it to be true. And that's really the extent of it. And it's fucked up. <laughs> Yeah, but in all fairness, Eric, I I think she said some anti-vax, anti-LGBTQ stuff, but I was pretty indifferent to that noise, and I didn't pay much attention. So you don't know. You you just are completely unaware. This guy does know. Fabian does know that Gina could fucking snap his arm in five seconds. If she wanted to. If she wanted to. Because he's that much of a fucking vagina. (laughs) Yeah, that's a fact. Let's uh, let's continue with this because uh, this is where Fabian goes. John, go stick a comic book up your butt, preferably a Treasury edition. Big fan of Tim Sheridan. <laughs> and you shout out Elton John, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> stop it, Elton. Cut that stigma. Fucking cut that shit out. Gotta stop that a stigma, man. Cut you, it out. you you take that stick out of this whatever the stick martyrs out of this whatever. I knew you were baiting debate. No, he d- he didn't bait shit. <laughs> he, didn't, he, didn't. he said, I don't follow Star Wars. <laughs> what exactly did she say that was so bad? He asked a question. You <laughs> fucking soy cock, fucking absolute embarrassment of a male. It's called a question, Fabian. Questions, oh, do you boy. understand them? <laughs> You answered it by saying, I ain't got a fucking clue. I'm retarded. But I'm going to have an opinion anyway because I got no fucking balls. I got told what to believe. I have no mind of my own whatsoever. No creative thought. I'm a writer for Main Street Comics. Duh. Should have put two and two together. And then when he says, right, so you've just said what we have just said because it's there. In black and fucking white. So you don't know what she said, but you think she got what she deserved. That's not a debate. That's not getting fucking dragged in to baiting. You answered it, you fucking numpty. <laughs> and your responses are, shove a comic book up your ass. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, I just made myself look a fucking moron because I am. And I got called out for being the fucking moron that I am. And uh, I'm just going to tell this sick of comic book, preferably a treasury edition, up your asshole. This is a big fan of Tim Sheridan and Jay Edgar Hoover. Shout out. Shout Jay out. Jay Edgar Hoover. <laughs> Shout fucking. out, Jay, Jay. And the truck stops, man. You got to fucking. <laughs> you gotta oh, and, uh, how did I get here? 
<laughs> How do these cocks get in my hand? Oh, oh well, well, Green Lantern in a comic book store not selling near you. <laughs> I knew you were baiting debate, but I gave you the benefit of the lead of your fucking shit. Yeah. You showed everyone what a tart you are. I oh, gave you the benefit of the doubt. He I, look, what exactly did she say that was bad? Where's the bait? It was a simple question. Where's the bait? As why don't you like the comic book industry for the mainstream right now? Okay, let me tell you. Let me yeah, tell you. It's not bait, it's a work. question. Well, legitimately. Legit question. You should go watch one of my real BBCs. You should go watch one of my ripping the silverbacks. We really go into that stuff there. You'll get a lot out of it. But good time. We try yeah. and we try and make it entertaining for you, unlike fucking comics. <laughs> Disney thought whatever look at this fucking hell let's let's just run run to yeah, protect oh, yeah. billion dollar corporation disney thought whatever she said warranted a preference to not be associated with her so my opinion isn't even part of the equation you responded to the question holy fuck can we get an iq test on fabian stat that it's definitely two figures but i want to know how fucking low it goes it's, 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 it's your wrong, iq it's it was it was 24 then it went down to six and now it's currently two is that your fucking iq scores fabian fuck my ass oh mouth and tits, my man. god this fucking jackass i mean like the question is okay yeah we we, we first of all we already know that much that disney they admitted <sighs> themselves, which may end up coming up, coming back to bite them in the ass. Oh yeah, that they found something that was abhorrent. That that it was that she said, right? That may be what blows this whole thing up to shit. When they came out publicly, be it through a spokesperson, basically a representative, approved narrative, conjured up or presented from Disney themselves, saying that she said things she never fucking said, right? So we know that 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 bit is that that bit is true, right? And you, Fabian, have just said that you think you think potentially may have possibly something happened, and something, something was said. something Disney. <laughs> yeah, something something went down that you feel like was anti whatever alphabet anti X Y and Z, and you had no issues bringing that up. You don't get to try to pull the punch, or rather, you already threw it, and now you're trying to hide it behind your fucking hand and act as if, well, I, I don't know what the, they they felt that it was it was this. You're still perpetuating a false narrative, Fabian. He doesn't and care. It, 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 that's the problem that he doesn't give a shit. He had no problem saying some things that were not true, and even just perpetuating the narrative, even in the same fucking sentence, admitting he doesn't even fucking know. He has no, no. idea. It's yeah. just it must it must be true. Billy Dollar yeah. Corporation said it must be true. Must be because they've never lied. <laughs> never once. <laughs> never once. You know they've never <laughs> Disney have been absolutely stand up company. Squeaky never queen. once got caught doing all kinds of fucking shenanigans from fucking pedo shit to try uh, child trafficking. Uh, you know going on right in their theme parks with their staff. No, don't worry about that. Don't need to report on that. Don't need to get that uh, going out there or anything like that whatsoever. No, 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 no. Don't know. I don't know shit about shit, and I got called out for not knowing shit about shit, and now I'm having a teddy tantrum because I got made to look like an absolute fucking fool. Do you know what I would do? Yeah, I would tell Fabian to go fuck himself. To get the fuck out. Hey, Fabian, can you come in my office, please? Sure. Fabian, can you get the fuck out my office now? And when you go, shut the door behind you. Keep walking. Go past your desk. Keep going to the stairs. You can take the lift if you really have to. Walk down. Get to the get to the reception. Hand your fucking card in. Keep going. Keep going. To get to the front door. When you get to the front door, open it. Walk out. You're free, Fabian. You're free. You're free. The world is your oyster because you're fired. <laughs> you're out. See you. Thanks for watching. Be sure to head over to Ripperverse.com to check out our comic book company. We have books, plenty of merchandise, and even some glorious animations from Ripperverse Studios. Next up, possibly our most anticipated book thus far, Yaira.